Hi, good afternoon, folks. Uh, this is Steve Cease uh, filling in for Tony Gonzalez this week as he is taking some uh, well-deserved vacation. Uh, but we'll pick up where he left off last week, and we're going to show you some nice uh, perennials that we have um, to ship out this week. Uh, nice bud and blooms and make your customers happy. Uh, this one here that we're starting off with, this is a new one that we have to offer. Uh, this is the Gallardia, otherwise known as the Blanket Flower. And as you can see, this one is loaded with uh, bud and blooms. This variety here is called the Gallardia Spin Top Yellow Touch. Uh, now keep in mind, this one's going to start blooming in June. It's got tons of flower power. And we've got just a handful of these. You can see in the background over there, if we zoom in here, this one here, as we get a little closer, that one is called the Spin Top Red. Now, that one has a solid red leaf, and if we come back here, you can look at this one here, which is going to give you that yellow color on the outer edges. So, don't hesitate to get these on your order. Uh, we don't have too many of them, but we got enough uh, to fill out some trucks for this next week. Again, this one is called the Gallardia, and this is the Spin Top series. Hello, uh, here we are. We're looking at some daylilies here towards the uh, back of the nursery. And I know the kids are back to school, uh, and the summer is coming towards an end, but thankfully with these daylilies, summer really isn't officially over, and neither is daylily season. This one you're looking at here uh, is a never-ending series. Thanks to the never-ending series, they keep blooming all summer long. Uh, this one here is a pink parfait and as you can see it's got a lot of nice bud and bloom. Really attractive flower. Uh, don't hesitate to get any of these on your order for next week. Again lots of flower power and we've got plenty of these in stock and they all look fantastic. There's nice clean foliage, nice bloom, they don't look tired. Uh, they look like they're just getting started. Uh, so again, this one here is the Pink Parfait, part of the Never Ending series. I wanted to show you a few more of the Never Ending series daylilies that we have. Uh, this one here is the Yellow Parfait. Uh, much like the Pink Parfait, as you can see, uh, it still has lots of flower power left in it, and it's just got a striking flower uh, that'll continue to rebloom. As you can see, it's got a little bit of red on the on the, the bloom as well as the yellow. Very striking. Again, nice clean foliage, great plants, and we've got plenty of these uh, to ship out as you can see. I wanted to show you just one more of the Never Ending Daylily series before we continue on out of uh, Daylily land here at the nursery. This one here is Peach Blast. Uh, zoom in again. This one has got a really nice looking flower. Different shades of red and pink. It's got that yellow throat. Nice clean foliage. Lots of bloom power. If you've got somebody looking for some nice fresh color you want to get on your benches or on a job, uh, this is a good one to go with. Again, we've got these in, in some pretty good numbers. Don't hesitate to, to give us a call and uh, we'll get these on your next order. Again, this is the Never Ending Series, Daylily Peach Blast. Here's a unique one that is uh, new to me this week as well. This one's called Calero. Uh, common name is Purple Poppy Mallow, if you can say that four or five times fast. But look at the uh, unique flower that it has on here. Just an, a really brilliant looking magenta colored flower. Now, this is a good alternative uh, for those of you who like to use geranium uh, roseanne, but maybe want to change up your designs a little bit, get something new. Uh, we've got plenty of these, a real nice crop, canning ready to go. Uh, again, this one is called Calero. Uh, that begins with a C. If you have any questions, please contact either your inside or outside sales rep, and we'll be more than happy to uh, get you some of these on your next order. We've got some really nice sedums, if uh, you're looking for some sedum for next week's order. Uh, this one here is a really unique one. Uh, nice uh, chartreuse bright yellow color. This is the sedum Angelina. 
Uh, it makes a great ground cover uh, for any sort of sunny location. Does like the sun, doesn't require a whole lot of water. And again, this one here, this is called Sedum Angelina. We've got about a handful of them, uh, not to underestimate it. So if you if you like what you see, uh, let us know. Talk to your inside rep, outside rep. We'll get these on order for you next week. Sedum Angelina. Here's another ground cover sedum that uh, may strike your fancy this next order. This one's called Sedum Blue Spruce. You see we got some pretty good numbers on this. This is a very drought tolerant variety. Uh, again, it's going to be a nice ground cover. Uh, gives you a very unique blue color. Uh, you can see where it gets its name from because it does uh, resemble uh, the needles of the Colorado Blue Spruce. Again, Sedum, Colorado Blue. Well, hello. Uh, just wrapping up this week's uh, video. I uh, hope you can hear over the wind as the wind is uh, picking up here out in the nursery. But I didn't want this week's video to get by uh, without letting you know the crops that we have on our perennial hibiscus. Uh, we've got a really nice crop. As you can see, these plants are just getting ready uh, to put on a show. And let me tell you, it's going to be a great performance. Uh, if you look at this one here, this is the perennial hibiscus uh, cranberry crush. Just an outstanding flower. Uh, most of our uh, perennial hibiscus are going to get uh, flowers that are anywhere between seven to eight inches uh, wide. Dinner plate size, as they, they say. Uh, as you can see, if I back out here, we just got a great crop of these. This is one variety that we have. Uh, we've got quite a few different varieties that are all uh, coming um, into uh, ready for shipping. And as you can see, they're loaded with buds. Some are starting to flower. This is the perfect time to get them on trucks. Uh, let me just give you one more look at this beautiful, beautiful flower. Again, this is the Hibiscus Cranberry Crush. Well, I thank you all for watching. I hope you enjoyed this week's uh, video, uh, the perennial video here at Willoway Nurseries.